All right, before this video starts, um, please just excuse my hair. I washed it and it has no idea what it's doing. And also these bruises, I walked into a wall yesterday. Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, we are bringing in the Christmas vibes once again, and I am giving you an advent calendar review. Now I'm sure you can already tell by the thumbnail and the title which advent calendar this is but it is the body shop calendar it is massive i didn't think it was going to be this big when i ordered it but it's literally huge it takes up the whole screen and i'm so so excited to give this a little look into and a little review so if you know anything about me, you know that I absolutely adore Christmas. I adore the whole lead up to it and everything like that. And I especially like advent calendars because they just create this excitement about when Christmas is coming and the countdown to it. So usually I would get a chocolate calendar, but this year I thought we would go a little bit more bougie and I bought one of the body shop calendars. So they have three different types. You can get the lower price, the higher price or the middle price. So I got the middle price so that you kind of get an idea of a li little bit of a taste of the lower and a little bit of a taste of the higher. And also cause gals on a budget and I've got to save because I've got to buy everyone Christmas presents. So I'm treating myself to the middle priced one and I'm so excited to open it up and show you what's in it. So first I just really want to take in on the detail on this because it is absolutely insane. Like it's such a nice like sleek material if that makes any sense and then it's got these cute little things on it so like this lady wearing a Christmas jumper, avocado, ornaments on the tree, cactus, llama, this little print going up on the wall like the detail in this is insane. There's such like minimal small like details that are popped on such a big canvas and they're so gorgeous and then on the back it does have all of the product descriptions which I'm not going to go into right away and I don't want to spoil the entire calendar but we are going to have a little bit of a sneak peek as to some of the products in it. Alright, so I've just popped it up on my table next to me and here's hoping that it does not fall over because I do not want all these boxes to come out and end up on my floor because God knows I will not be able to put it back together like this again even though it has instructions on the back. <laughs> hey Siri, pick a number between 1 and 25. A random number between 1 and 25 is 1. Okay, so we're starting off with day one. Very suitable. So this is the box for day one. And on the side, it just says, Millions of people all over the world are homeless. Help those in need by volunteering at your local shelter this Christmas. So that is just an example of one of the things on the side of the box, which basically just give you an idea of how you can help this Christmas. So we're going to open it and see what is inside. Oh, that's a bit cute. It's a little coconut hand cream. I love coconut. It's literally one of my favorite scents ever. It's actually quite a nice size to be fair. Like you don't want a hand cream to be too big. Day one, can't complain. That's really cute. I'm gonna pop it back in the box and pop it back in the advent calendar so that we can open it again in December. <laughs> Pick a number between one and 25. The answer is 11. Siri seems to be going in with the ones today. Okay, where is number 11 on here? 11, 11, 11. Alrighty, 11 is this one here. If I can get it out. Oh my goodness. Ugh. Okay, it hasn't collapsed yet, thank God. But this is number 11. It's just got a little gingerbread man on the front of it. It's not focusing on it, but I promise there's a gingerbread man on there. And let's see what they have in store for day 11. Oh my God. It's another coconut product. It is a coconut bubble bath. Oh my god, bath bubble, same thing. Oh my god, that smells insane. Alrighty, Mr. Gingerbread Man is back in there again. So pick a number between 1 and 25. It's 13. Alrighty, 13. Let's open that one up. I've actually been dying to open this one up. It just keeps like attracting my attention. So I'm actually really glad we get to open 13. It is this strangely shaped box with a little decorated cactus on the front, which is actually so sweet. And we're gonna open it up and see what we get. Oh, you're joking. This looks so nice. It is a vitamin E moisturizer cream, which is basically just like bougie moisturizer. 
Oh my god, that smells insane. I'm so excited to use that. It smells really summery too. Oh, if I could get the lid back on, which I'm super excited for because obviously in Australia, Christmas is in summer. So you can guarantee from the 13th, obviously I'm going to absolutely be lathering this on my skin. The answer is 23. Getting close to Christmas, getting close to Christmas. Okay, number 23 is this one here with a little, it's either a holly or that thing that people kiss under, a mistletoe. <laughs> Can't relate. <laughs> so this is number 23, how gorgeous is that? So we are halfway through the eight that I'm going to be showing you. <gasps> oh my God, I'm actually so excited for this one. This is so cute. It's a little star headband. This is honestly part of the reason that I got this because this is just so sweet. Probably use this to put on like a face mask or to do your makeup with. And it's just like, it's all year round kind of pattern, but also very Christmassy. Oh my God, I love that they have that in there. That's so cute. Oh my God, I'm so excited for Christmas. <laughs> four down and four to go. Pick a number between one and 25. <laughs> it's 20. Oh, all right, number 20. The thing is, these would probably be easier to get out if I had the box laying down, but we're doing it struggle way today because I want you to see the beauty that is this box. But I seriously cannot get this one out. All right, finally. Okay. So, this is number 20. It's got a little, like, boop, 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 trumpet. <laughs> so, this is number 20 and it's got one of those, like, megaphones on it and not a trumpet. Um, and inside here, what do we have? Oh, my God. Cute. I love all the tiny little pots. This is a little mango lip butter. Oh my god, that's so sweet. It's got the like seal on it, obviously, because they want you to know that it hasn't been used before. So I'm going to leave it in here. But I'm so excited to try that. Again, very, very Australian summary. My dog's just woken up, so I'm just going to let her out of the room real quick. Alrighty, we're back to it, and we've got three more to open, and I'm super excited to see what's in there. Choose a number between 1 and 25. The answer is 8. Number 8 is this one right at the top. So cute. It's this little snowman and I think it's just so sweet. And let's see what's inside. The packaging on these is actually really impressive by the way. I haven't ripped any yet so here's hoping I don't rip this one. This one is a face mask which is perfect for whichever one it was, it was a bit 23 with the little headband in it and it is a Himalayan charcoal purifying glow mask and I really wanted a face mask so oh it smells really fresh. I'm really excited to be able to use this on the 8th of December. <laughs> it's 12. All right number 12. Where is that? This massive one here, oh my god, I'm so excited. So this one here is kind of weighty and as you can see, it is a little nutcracker guy on there and it's so cute. So I have a feeling this is probably like a full product, but as to what it is inside here, I have no idea. It is a Calamar Gentle Eye Makeup Remover. Oh my god, I literally need something like this because I just scrub up my eyes with a face washer which obviously is not great and now I have a full-sized bottle of eye makeup remover that is suitable for sensitive skin hell yeah preach to the gods and the final one I'm going to show you for today is pick a number between 1 and 25 it's 14 number 14 I'm really surprised we didn't get number 25 a little bit gutted but that's okay number 14 is Nowhere to be found. These triangle ones are so tricky. Ugh. This one on the side, I know I haven't shown you all of the little like detailing on the side, but this one just has this message here and it says, homeless women on the streets are even more vulnerable than men. If you see a homeless woman, ask how you can help. I just love that they all have this like little message as to how you can help during Christmas and like all year round especially, but during Christmas as well. I just think that's so sweet. It also has this little car with a Christmas tree in it on the front for the decoration. And they also have it written in a different language, the little message. I think it's written in French, which is very, very cool. And inside is a coffee awakening mask, which is so cute. I'm not a huge coffee drinker, but I don't mind the smell of it. So, very strong. <laughs> Definitely would wake me up. 
So that's a little bit of an insight into the medium sized body shop calendar. I think it is so worth the money. Like I only opened one of the big products I think it was and you could see how much you get for like what you spend. And there's still so many that I didn't get a chance to open. So I'm really excited to open this during Christmas time. I am actually going to be doing Vlogmas. So keep an eye out on my channel for that and you will be able to see all of the things that come in this calendar. There is also a secret message on the other side of these boxes. Sorry, my camera just cut out, but there is also a secret message on the other side of all of these boxes, which will be revealed as December goes on. So make sure you watch my vlogmases so that you can see the message on the other side of this and invest in one of these calendars because they are so worth the money. And yes, we all love chocolate, but we all love pampering ourselves too. So you might as well get yourself one of these, even if you want to get one of a chocolate one as well. <laughs> So if you enjoyed this video and you're super excited for Christmas like I am, make sure that you give it a huge thumbs up. Comment down below, tell me what your favourite product that you saw was, if you'll be investing in this calendar and any other advent calendars that you recommend. There's so many around and I know so many of them are amazing, but this is the one I decided to invest in this year. And subscribe for more content and I will see you in the next one, hopefully with some more Christmas content very soon because I'm so excited for it to be December. <laughs>